Do you remember Elastigirl from The Incredibles? She's the mom, also known as Mrs. Parr. Her superpower is elasticity and flexibility. Pixar never told us how she gained this superpower or what she's made of. I want to find out exactly what her body is made of by calculating her Young's modulus. Pixar gave us some very useful information. I know that Elastigirl is 1.72 meters tall and her mass is 56 kilograms. She can stretch over a distance of 30 meters and be stretched to a thickness of 1 millimeter before she snaps. I'm going to use three physics equations in this video. Equation to find strain, stress, and Young's modulus. First equation, strain is the change in length divided by the original length. From what is seen in the movie, her arm is approximately one-third of her height. So let's make the assumption that the length of her arm is roughly 0.57 meters. The strain works out to be 52.6. Second equation. There was the scene in the movie where Elastigirl hangs from a train going over a bridge and one of her arms is fully stretched. So the force acting on her arm is just her own weight. If I approximate gravitational field strength to be 10 newtons per kilogram, and I know that her mass is 56 kilograms, then the force acting on her arm is 560 newtons. When Elastigirl stretches her arm to a minimum thickness of 1 millimeter, by then her arm is more or less a thin rectangle. And according to research, adult humans on average have a wrist width of 3.14 centimeters. If Elastigirl's rectangular arm is 1 millimeter thick, and 3.14 centimeters wide, I can now work out the cross-sectional area. So we're now ready to calculate the stress. Now that we know the stress and the strain, we can plug these numbers into the Young's modulus equation. Young's modulus is stress over strain, so the Young's modulus of Elastigirl's arm works out to be 3.39 times 10 to the power 5 pascals. So the order of magnitude is 10 to the power 5 pascals. Let's compare this to the Young's modulus scale of different common materials. The Young's modulus of muscles and tissues is in the region of 10 to the power of 3 pascals. At the top end of the scale, we have tendons and bones. Elastigirl's Young's modulus is closest to skin and cartilage. Not quite rubber, which was one of the materials that I thought she might be made of. So if anybody out there is purely made of skins and cartilage without any bones or tendons, you are the next Elastigirl.